Did you know there's a vast growing anomaly in Earth's magnetic field that NASA is closely monitoring? This is no science fiction plot, but a real-life phenomenon known as the South Atlantic Anomaly, or SAAA for short, an expansive region of weakened magnetic intensity. The SAA stretches all the way from South America to Southwest Africa. But why should we care about this anomaly? Well, it's not so friendly to our technology. Satellites and spacecraft that venture through this region may experience malfunctions, the result of exposure to high-energy particles from the sun. Imagine being in a storm, but instead of rain and wind, you're bombarded with solar particles. Not the most ideal conditions for our tech gear, right? So, what causes this vast growing anomaly in Earth's magnetic field? You might be wondering, what's causing this South Atlantic anomaly? Well, scientists believe that the South Atlantic Anomaly, or SAA, is primarily caused by disruptions in Earth's magnetic field. Now, what's interesting is that these disruptions are generated by the swirling ocean of molten iron in our planet's outer core. Think of it like a giant spinning liquid metal dynamo, constantly churning and moving. This dynamic process creates our planet's magnetic field, but it's not always uniform, and that's where the SAA comes into play. The other major contributor to the SAA is something known as the African Large Low Shear Velocity Province. It's a mouthful, isn't it? This is a massive area deep within Earth's mantle beneath the African continent. The region's unique structure and composition influence the generation of our planet's magnetic field, contributing to the creation of the SAA. Now, you might be thinking that this sounds like a recent phenomenon, something that sprung up in our lifetime or perhaps the last few centuries. But that's not the case. In fact, Recent studies suggest that the SAA is not a new occurrence at all. It may have existed for millions of years, waxing and waning, shifting and changing, but always there. NASA researchers have been keeping a close eye on the SAA and they've made some fascinating observations. The SAA appears to be splitting into two distinct cells. This suggests that there are ongoing changes in its structure, and it's evolving in ways we're only beginning to understand. The Earth is a dynamic, ever-changing planet, and the South Atlantic Anomaly is a perfect example of this. It's a reminder that even as we reach for the stars, there's still so much to discover about our own home. Now that we know what causes the South Atlantic Anomaly, let's consider the potential impacts it could have. The South Atlantic Anomaly isn't just an interesting scientific phenomenon, it has potential impacts that are worth understanding. The South Atlantic Anomaly, or SAA, is more than just an intriguing wrinkle in Earth's magnetic field. It's a region that poses significant risks, especially to our satellites and spacecraft. As they pass through this area of weakened magnetic intensity, they are exposed to high-energy particles from the Sun. These particles can potentially cause malfunctions and disruptions to the normal functioning of these delicate machines. This is a concern for both commercial satellite operators and space agencies alike. This anomaly is like a pothole on the highway of space travel, posing a risk to our technological assets that traverse this route. But the impacts of the SAA aren't restricted to space. Changes in Earth's magnetic field can also affect the stunning natural light displays we know as auroras. These spectacular shows of light seen near the poles are the result of charged particles from the sun interacting with our planet's magnetic field. As the SAA changes and evolves, it could alter these beautiful displays changing their location, intensity, and frequency. The South Atlantic Anomaly is an active and evolving feature. It's not static. In fact, recent observations indicate that it's splitting into two distinct cells, signifying ongoing changes in its structure. This makes it even more critical to continue monitoring and researching this phenomenon. The more we understand about the SAA, the better we can predict its behavior. And this isn't just about protecting our satellites or enjoying auroras. This is about understanding our planet, its magnetic field, and how it interacts with the sun and the wider cosmos. As we continue to explore the vastness of space, understanding phenomena like the South Atlantic Anomaly becomes even more crucial. This is just one piece of the cosmic puzzle, and as we delve deeper into the universe, it's these pieces that will help us make sense of our place in it.